he just followed his heart. Laura Raguso tearfully recounted the time her son, FDNY Lieutenant Christopher Raguso, told her he was giving even more to his community and country by rejoining the Air National Guard. And I said, Papi, please, why do you have to do this? And he said, Mommy, because if I don't, who's going to do it? And I begged him not to do it. Raguso was among seven airmen who died when their HH-60 Pave Hawk search and rescue helicopter crashed in western Iraq. The incident is under investigation, though it does not appear to be the result of enemy contact. Four of the seven killed are from New York, including Raguso and FDNY Fire Marshal Christopher Tripp Zanetas. I know it's a very sad day for the fire department, but it must be such a proud day, and it is such a proud day to know that you have people like this that serve your department and serve your country at the same time. These are remarkable human beings. Today at Raguso's Brooklyn Firehouse, the Tunnel to Towers Foundation made the financial commitment to help pay off his family's mortgage, a home where his wife lives with their two little girls. Raguso's father-in-law accepted the gift on his family's behalf. I want to thank all of you for all you've done. There is no word that I can use or say to describe the feelings that I have for you men and women.